Hi, preschool friend. Miss Julie here. I have a story for you for Mother's Day, and this one is called My Monster Mama Loves Me So. It is written by Laura Luke, and the pictures are by Mark Boyner. Here we go. My monster mama loves me so. How many eyes does this monster have? You see the monster mama? How many eyes does she have? One, two, three eyes. We only have two, don't we? Swinging. Looks like fun. My monster mama loves me so. Let me tell you how I know. How many arms does Mama have here? How many arms? Shall we count them? Look, let's go by the hands here. One, two, there's the arms right here. Two arms on one side. And she must have two arms on the other side too. She's got four arms, this Mama, this monster Mama. When I wake up, she tweaks my nose. Tickles all my pointy toes, combs the cobwebs from my bangs, and makes sure that I brush my fangs. They don't have teeth, they've got fangs, they're monsters. She gives me great big hairy hugs, bakes me cookies filled with bugs. And when I'm sick, she's twice as nice. She gives me lizard juice with ice. He's sick. Look, she's got a worried look on her face. She's giving him an, a cool pack for his forehead and giving him lizard juice with ice. He's got lizards on his, dinosaurs on his bedspread and all kinds of critters on there. And, oh, there's a snake on his, wound around his bed stand here. And scary things and lots of cobwebs. They like cobwebs in this, in the monster world. She helps me climb the jungle gym. Takes me to the swamp to swim. I see lots of swamp creatures there. There's Monster Mama and her monster child. And there's frogs and another frog and some weird creature here and a snake up in the tree and a bat. Some eyes of other things peeking at us. And the water is glowing in that swamp. Ew. She comes to all my beast ball games. She claps and stamps and roars my name along with the crowd here. Yay! Go! Make a strike! Yay! Make a home run! Make a home run! Not a strike. Home run! Yay! And when the scary things come out, to wave their arms and scream and shout. What are they talking about here, friend? They're talking about the boys and girls. They're really scary to the monsters. And when the scary things come out, to wave their arms and scream and shout, she tells me, don't be frightened, dear, and shows me how to disappear. On rainy, windy, stormy days, she breathes and makes a cozy blaze. We read some books, toss on more logs, sing camping songs, and roast hot dogs. Oh, look, his hot dog got in fire there. Hot dogs, camping songs, reading by the fire. Ooh, thunder and lightning. It is a stormy day in this book. On summer evenings after dark, we go strolling through the park. 
We practice tricks I've learned today and gaze up at the Milky Way. The Milky Way is a collection of stars. You're watching the stars. Look, they both have more than two arms, four arms. And when the moon sets in the sky, she sings a monster lullaby of things that shriek and moan and creep, soothing things to help me sleep. He's a monster. He likes those things that shriek and moan and creep, because monsters do. Do you see anything special in the clouds in this picture? Look real closely. Real closely. Do you see anything in the clouds? I see a bunny. Do you see it? And I see a kitty cat. Right there. There's the bunny with the big long ears and the poofy tail. Yeah. You can look for pictures in the clouds. It's fun. She tucks me tightly into bed, then asks me if my spider's fed, and hangs my favorite bat above me. That's how I know my mama loves me. Look at all the creepy stuff he has in his room. Lots of bugs and many, many spider webs. Oops, one other thing is true. Your monster mama loves you too. The end. Wasn't that fun? Monster mama. Happy Mother's Day. Bye, friend.